Who is the real Wagatha Christie? Despite losing her legal case against Colleen Rooney, Rebecca Vardy has trademarked the phrase Wagatha Christie. But is this a shrewd move or is it an own goal? My name's Samantha Ray and I'm outside the Ambassadors Theatre in Covent Garden to ask the audience of Vardy v Rooney. that you could be persuaded to buy with the Wagatha Christie logo on it, like a dog bowl or a bean bag or a Prosecco glass? Absolutely nothing. I'm Team Rooney. Rebecca Vardy trademarked Wagatha Christie. Is that a good idea? It's a terrible idea when you lose and you're trademarking a loss. What are you actually going for with that? <laughs> Rooney all the way. Would you buy anything with Wagatha Christie on it? No. Rooney. 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 Will you be buying any merchandise with Wagatha Christie? I won't be buying merchandise, but I think it was a really clever idea of hers. I am Team Rooney. <laughs> Do you think it was a good move for Rebecca Vardy to trademark Wagatha Christie? Yes, that is clever. That is money, honey. Did she? That's yeah, that's, that's quite genius, actually. Yeah, not gonna lie. Well done. Yeah. That's clever. That's yeah. a that's a Kardashian move. That <laughs> Team Rooney all the way. Do you buy anything with the Wagatha Christie logo on it? No. No. Does she, will she do a collaboration with somebody? <laughs> I'm Team Vardy. I think she had a lot of abuse and I'm not sure she really did it. Would you buy anything with the Wagatha Christie logo on it? No. We are Team Rooney. Would you buy anything with Wagatha Christie on it? Not unless it's by the real Agatha Christie. Absolutely 1000% not. How could she trademark it when she didn't invent the term? So, is the lighting good? <laughs> Rebecca Vardy trademarked Wagatha Christie. Was that a good idea or an own goal? Own goal. Good for her. Why not? What do you think of Vardy trademarking Wagatha Christie? Has she done that? She has absolutely no right. <laughs> don't, don't, don't put that on there. No, that's that's awful. It's If anything, she lost, so she has to move on. Do you buy anything with the Wagatha Christie logo on it? Probably not. <laughs> <laughs> After today, probably, yeah. Maybe a baseball cap. That trademarking Wagatha Christie was a shrewd move or an own goal? Absolutely shocking, own goal. Own goal. Clever. Well, let's that's see what she does with it. It definitely shows her character. That's just like her saying, yes, it's all true. Everything you think about me, I'm just a money grabber. Team oh, Rooney, for sure. Because you're Scouse. Yeah, we've got to be. Um, I just <laughs> want to know who did it. That's all I want to know. That's why I'm here. It was Rebecca Vardy's account, duh. Rebecca Vardy has trademarked Wagatha Christie. Is that a good idea or is that an own goal? I think that's an own goal. Unlikely I would buy anything with that logo, but I think she's done really well to protect her own interests going forward. Team Vardy or Team Colleen? I have no idea. If you saw the Wagatha Christie logo on it, what would you buy? Oh, the tickets. Would you buy anything with the Wagatha Christie logo on it? Probably not, no. Do you think it's a good move or do you think it's an own goal? Possibly an own goal. Not a good idea. I can see she's trying to claw back her money now. Would you buy any merchandise with Wagatha Christie on it? Yeah, why not? I feel sorry for her at this stage. Uh, yes, yes, yes. I'd feel I I buy it just because I feel sorry for her as well. So yeah. I'm waiting for a divorce and buying her <laughs> divorce papers. <laughs> and a Peter Andre Chipolada. I've worried wet theatregoers about the Wagatha Christie trademark, but the lack of interest in logoed merchandise means Rebecca Vardy is unlikely to make a dent in her estimated £3 million legal bill. I'm Samantha Ray in Covent Garden.